Welcome to the Book of Remembrance. This message was received from the Lord Jesus on June the 29th, 2016. The title of the message is Rapture Day. And the Lord Jesus began. It pleases me to see that some of you, my children, are ready for my return. It feels good for someone to be looking forward to seeing me. For millennia, people went about their lives without giving much thought to my return. Now, things have changed. My brides can sense my approach, and they are delighted by it. And so you should be, for the wonders I have planned for you will blow your minds. Have you imagined my return, my child? Look around you. Maybe you're going to work, to school, or to church, or you're at a restaurant, or at a mall. Maybe you are at a family reunion, or on vacation. Can you imagine me returning to you at this very moment? Time will stop in the sense that it will be the end of one era and the beginning of another. Think about it. How many people that you are with right now, how many will be raptured and how many will be left behind? In that moment in time, everything will change. Can you imagine the pain of those witnessing your departure? Maybe you are having dinner with a friend and all of a sudden the trumpet sounds. You are changed as you put on immortality and then you are slowly lifted up. Can you imagine the expression on your face, my bride, as you realize that I have arrived to come and get you? What about those left behind? I tell you, it will be like any other normal day. Some will be working, some will be watching TV, those who are asleep will be awakened by the trumpet blast. Some will be playing sports, others will be on the farm working, caring for their animals, others will be out walking their pets, others will be out robbing a store others driving, others flying on a plane. My brides, it will be a normal day where people are doing what they normally do. There will be no preceding sign to show that the day of rapture is here. There will be no unusual signs in the sky that day. It will be a normal, regular day with everyone going about their business until the trumpet sounds and then everything will change. When the trumpet sounds, the clock in heaven will have struck midnight, and immediately after the rapture, it will once again start counting down the seven years of the Great Tribulation period. Yes, indeed, one era, the Age of Grace, will end, and another era will begin, the Age of Judgment, when my wrath will be poured out on the inhabitants of the earth. It truly is astonishing how many people are blind to my return. The signs are everywhere that time is up but many people are still walking around with blinders on. It is time to wake up, people. Some will hear this message and reevaluate themselves. They will come to me, humble themselves, and seek my face. I will not hide myself. I will be found by them, and they will find answers to the questions they have in their hearts. And surprisingly, many of these will make it to heaven on the day of rapture, because they decided to heed my voice this day and turn back to me. They will be the last minute harvest, the ones many thought would never make it to heaven when they died, let alone make it to heaven through the rapture. You see, right now I am pouring out much grace and mercy, and to whoever desires my presence, I will be present to you. Whoever gets under the shower of mercy and grace that I am pouring, to him much mercy and grace will be shown. It is not for a specific people or a specific religion. Heaven right now is open to whoever wills to come there. The only condition is that you must accept me, Jesus, as your Lord and Savior. Confess this with your heart and with your mouth and repent of all your sins. There is no other way to heaven but by me. No one will see my Father except they come to him through me. There are no shortcuts and no other way. There is only one way, me, Jesus. Do not be deceived by those who say that there are many ways to me. That is a lie. I am the way, the truth, and the life. No one comes to the Father but by me. You cannot con your way into heaven. You cannot bribe, kill, steal, begain, exchange, or buy your way into heaven. It is only through me. And if you reject me, woe unto you. For the only other path is the one that leads to Satan's abode. Hell. Drop your pride and come to me, or stay in your sin and go to the place of eternal. And eternal means exactly that, 
eternal, everlasting, never-ending damnation. Choose. Amen. And that was the end of the message from the Lord Jesus. Be blessed, beloved.